Yes, sir. in there? Do we have to do the whole get a warrant again? That I know when there's somebody in the home, they have to go get a warrant, but that doesn't, you have to, you have to make sure that the home is okay. Right, yeah. Remember, it, two hours later, then they have to leave the house, go get a warrant, and you have to go. Does that make There's people sense? in there right now, yeah, and they got crisis yeah. Yeah. But, uh, but, you know what? What's going on? Sir, if you could tell us your name, spell your last name and position. Lieutenant Anthony Dupree, D-U-P-R-E-E. -E. I'm with the San Diego Police Homicide Unit. Thank you, sir. Can you tell us what happened this morning? This morning, about 6.20, San Diego police received a radio call regarding a burglary in progress at the 6300 block of Lakeshore Drive. The reporting party stated that her husband was fighting with someone inside their house. Uh, the reporting party also indicated that her husband may have shot, her, actually her son may have shot, shot the suspect. Uh, officers got here pretty quickly. Um, once they got on scene, they found the victim, which is her husband, down with trauma to his upper body. The suspect was in the backyard in the pool area with uh, gunshot wounds to his upper body. First day he was provided to the husband. The uh, suspect was pronounced deceased there at the scene. The husband was transported to a local hospital where he is currently listed in stable condition. It's early on in our investigation, and that's all we have right now. We don't know the point of entry, how the suspect got into the house. That'll be all part of the investigation. Do you know what kind of trauma the husband had? Uh, he had stab wounds stab throughout wounds. his upper body. About how many? I don't know. Okay. So Multiple. is the suspect unknown to the family? At this point, we think they are. So it was a random break-in? As far as we know. Again, it's early on in the investigation. We hadn't gotten to that point. We hadn't interviewed the, uh, the wife and the son. And of course, the husband, we hadn't, hadn't been able to get a statement from yet. Who else was in the house? Was there, there, there was a husband and a 20-year-old son. The uh, suspect's probably in his 30s, a mixed-race male, uh, and that's all we have for him. The husband is about 54 years old. Do you know was the condition? son also fighting with the burglar? I don't have that. I don't, I don't think he was, but I can't confirm that. Okay. And the wife was in the house also? Correct. Do you know the wounds to the suspect? Was he, was he in fact shot? We think he has gunshot wounds to the upper body. Again, we have to examine that a little closer. Do you know what condition the husband is in? He's in stable condition. That's what we got from the hospital at this point. Age when, of the husband, please? 54 years old. 54 and the, and the son's 20? Correct. And the suspect? In his 30s, mid to late 30s. When the suspect was found in the pool, did any officers go into the pool to recover him? They did pull him out of, out of the pool. He's not in the pool any longer. And they did CPR? or was Well, he was, they, he was pronounced deceased there by medics. Medics had arrived by the time they pulled him out of the pool. Any idea of kind of the, I guess, fighting that led to that? Just how long that would have been? No, no, we don't. Again, we haven't spoken to the son, hadn't spoken to the wife. Um, so we don't know. So that'll, that'll all be part of the investigation. And then this area blocked off for a long time? Yeah, it'll be a while. For a couple of hours, we'll have this, at least this half of the street blocked off. Was the knife recovered? 
There's a knife there at the scene. I don't know if that is the uh, weapon. So again, this is all assumption, but the, 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 it would appear that the prowler has a knife, the son has a gun. That's what we, that's what we were getting initially. Again, it's early on in our investigation. Do you know and how many somehow times? there's an altercation. There was an altercation inside. Uh, as far as the gun, is it registered to the father, to the son? Don't know that. It's too early in the investigation. Do you know how many times the suspect was shot? No, I don't know. Was the suspect shot more than once? Uh, we, we think he was shot more than once, but we don't know how many times he was shot. But the father has multiple wounds, stab wounds, so up from, torso. from what we were told, we haven't seen him yet. That's what we were told. And then any idea what the thief was in here to try to get? Any signs no. of any actual no. taking anything? There's a, obviously an auto parked out here, Preston's repair. It's way too early to just, you know, that, that, that somehow this suspect thought he, you know, they had money or yeah. something. You know, we, we don't know. We don't know. Yeah. I, th I think the, I haven't been in the backyard, but I think the, um, the bike portion of the yard opens up to like an open area, maybe a golf course or something. Who knows? He probably walking by and saw it. But again, it's early on in the investigation. What hospital was he taken to? Uh, we don't disclose that at this point. Um, and did any other neighbors report any unusual stuff happening um, at their homes? No, I, I think we haven't talked to any neighbors. I know uh, some have reported hearing gunshots. Okay. But no, there weren't any other crimes reported in any other not that we, Not that we're aware of. And then the type of gun that the son used to defend the house? I don't know what it is, and we wouldn't disclose it at this point anyway. Is the and suspect's body still in the yard? In the back correct. The, uh, you're not disclosing the name of the uh, husband? No, we're not, not at this point, no. Um, and you said no signs of entry, so there wasn't like a... We don't know. We haven't we, had, we hadn't gotten that point in our investigation yet. Okay. Have you been able to ID the, the, the deceased victim? The suspect has not been identified yet. And no relation to the family? Not that we're aware of. Anything that we're missing that you'd like to add on? No, that's it on my part. Thank you. Anybody else? You're welcome. Thank you, sir. Okay, thank, thank you. you very much.